Hey Nuggets, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know it's been a while since I posted. I've been having a hard time, but I'm getting better now and I wanna start posting videos again because I've missed it and I missed you guys. I've also been working on the morph tutorial like I said I would. I'm gonna show you what it looks like right now. I'm gonna start actually recording it. That was just a practice of how I wanted the morph to look at the end of the video so yeah <laughs> today in this video i just want to show you some really cute mesh heads that i saw in the shop i gathered five of them two are from the same creator and i think the other ones are like separate so i'm going to show you right now so these are the heads that i'm going to be showing in this video i'm going to put them together and show you how to make it look good for some of you that don't know how you would do that there's literally just one that's really expensive the other ones are kind of affordable and there's one that's cheaper than the rest which is the darker one by the creator called ambria if i even said that right <laughs> but yeah let me show you the first one i want to do first so this is what the mesh looks like I need to put some things off of my avatar so you can see it right so she is looking really really cute so that you can have this head two ways you can have it on with whatever eyebrow accessory that you have or you can take off the eyebrow accessory and wear where the brows that the head comes with and they look like this they're really really cute I actually would wear it just the way it is the lips look really cute and it would really help you with morph edits and stuff so yeah i love how it seemingly blends with my avatar skin as well and it doesn't look like a bad mesh i actually know who this creator is she's really really good at these um she's been improving she also did a yasmin one and yasmin has it on too <laughs> Um, I'll show you the Yasmin one. It's gonna look crazy when I put it on, but she made it work because it's Yasmin. <laughs> yeah, this is her shop, and this is the Yasmin mesh I'm talking about. She did a really good job on it. This is what it looks like. Of course, it looks crazy, like I said, because I need to fix it and stuff. This is what she's called if you want to go search her up. And um, so, yeah, I'm going to also change the eye color that my avatar has it's gonna be like really random okay so i feel like it's the eyeliner so i need to take it off she looks so cute doesn't she yeah this is such a really really cute mesh and i think you would like it you won't have to do too much with the mesh just change the brows if you want to or the eye color put some cute lashes on I can tell you what lashes I have on right now. It's by By My High. Actually, no, it's not. It's by, um, I can't say her name, but I'm gonna sh show you what her name is on the screen right now. But this is what the lashes are called. So you could just search it up and you'll find it. And yeah, I'm gonna show you the next mesh by the same creator. This is the head right here. It kind of looks like the other one because of the head, but it actually doesn't look that similar. The brows are definitely the same, but yeah, this is another really cute one. I love the lips. They look really cute and glossy and it's so pretty. So yeah, I really think you would love this mesh if you want to go get it. Oh my gosh, I did not even show the name of the first head that I showed. This is the name of the head, the first one, and this is the second one. Now let's move on to the third head I want to show you. So this person has this mesh in other colors as well, a light version and this color and a darker color of this. I like this one. The other one didn't have that much color. It looked more white and I was thinking maybe the head should have had more saturation. I'll show you what I mean. But this is what she looks like. Again, you don't really have to do anything. It just blends nicely with any dark skin, brown skin to go with this mesh. It kind of goes with the one I'm wearing right now, just kind of, not really. You can tell from the neck, it doesn't match. 
so that's what you need to look out for when you use meshes some people don't and they just use any skin and they don't realize that you got them still try to match it anyway yeah this is another cute one i think it's just perfect the way it is you don't gotta do anything that's what's so good about these meshes again i didn't show the name of it this is what it's called right here so this is the other one i was talking about i wish it had a bit more saturation like it was a bit like the same color as my avatar skin at the moment because i i think it just looks a little white but it's still cute if someone if any of you actually likes the color of it right now that's the dark version of the head i wanted to add this head into the list because it's also really really cute it's a Nicki minaj inspired mesh head i didn't add it because i don't think you would be able to find a skin that matches this mess but it's also a really good night uh, i can't speak a really nicely made mesh and just in case you want to know what it's called this is what the mesh head is called so you can go search it up so i wasn't sure if i wanted to add this one because she does kind of look odd but then when i was fixing it more I realize it kind of looks cute when her eyes aren't facing forward. It looks cute when the eyes are facing like left or right. And her brows, if you wanted to use an accessory brow for this head, it's not gonna look cute because the brow just fades into the, the skin of the mesh and it's weird. I don't know why it does that. I'll use a different brow that I have and see if it does the same thing. Yeah, it does it to that one as well. I guess maybe if you, so you would have to use the brows that isn't an accessory. You know, when you just go to the shop, go on eyes and eyebrows, yeah. So that's what makes it look cute. It's a really different mesh and I think the mesh looks unique as well. I randomly put these these brows on her just to check if it works because I thought it would not even show up but it looks really nice on her and the lashes suit her as well I was going to use different ones because at first when I was planning out picking out these meshes I put on these different lashes they didn't really go but this one does and now the last one that I want to show you is oh wait I am so horrible right now I keep forgetting to do this. This is what the mesh is called. And it's actually so pretty in the thumbnail. That, that's how I was trying to get it to look. But I just couldn't. I wish I could find those lashes. I'm not even going to lie. I wish I could find it. Um, the head has two different versions. I picked the one that didn't come with eyebrows. Um, this is the one that has eyebrows. I prefer the one that doesn't. So you can just pick your own. Because the one that does come with brows... It's kind of faded. I like the version where you can just put in your own eyebrow onto the head instead. So now I'm gonna show you the last eyebrow. I'm, oh my God, I can, what is wrong with me today? I cannot make a video, right? I'm gonna show you the last head. <laughs> I think it looks really, really cute. Her features give Belasian vibes. It looks really nice and it won't be hard to find a skin to match this mesh. Just get one that is like pink toned and yeah, you'd be fine. It should match. But yeah, this is the last one and I'm gonna show you what it's called. And to make this head look really good, you would want to use eyes looking to the right or left, not forward, because I feel like it doesn't look that cute. I would show you right now. Actually, never mind, it does. <laughs> I think I mistaked it with a different mesh. And I think I forgot to take the eyeliner off because the eyeliner that I have kind of covers some of the eyes a bit. And then, yeah, and I, I thought it was the lashes. Maybe the lashes were too big. Yeah, this she looks really, really cute. And again, this mesh doesn't go with and this, those accessory eyebrows like the last one it just fades into the mesh so you would have to use just normal eyebrows 
that work on the normal heads that don't need those kind of eyebrows but yeah she looks really really cute and i hope that you like this video and i hope that helped you out if you're trying to make a new avatar right now or you're someone who is a mesh head person and you couldn't find any good ones in the shop or something i hope i held i hope I helped you out and if you got any questions tell me in the comments my morph tutorial will be out in the next few days and yeah i'll see you in my next video